Greetings and welcome to another edition of the Jacksonville Buzz. I am your host, Adrienne Houghton. Now, each week I like to feature unique businesses, causes, events or people from throughout the First Coast. Today's no exception. I'm delighted to welcome into the studio Mr. Derek Richardson from dsellsjacks.com. Welcome, Derek. Thank you. I appreciate being here. So, before we find out exactly what you do, tell me about Derek. Um, I'm just a young entrepreneur or workerpreneur, as I would like to call it. Uh, born and raised here in Jacksonville, went to uh, college here locally and everything like that. So, I forgot kind of tired of the corporate world, just kind of jumped into what exactly that I do. So we'll keep it a secret until you start asking the question. Keep it a <laughs> secret. So what do you do? What is D sells Jacks? I mean, you're not selling pieces of Jacksonville or are you? I actually am. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm actually a realtor, um, buying, selling, helping with investing, as well as I have my own like property management company on the side too, but mainly focused in real estate though. And did you always want to be a realtor? No, I actually didn't. So actually, once I bought my first um, home purchase myself, a townhouse back in about, I think it was like 2018. So going through the process of my realtor is what kind of like had me interested in it. So from there is when I kind of started looking into it and I didn't do it until actually the pandemic started. So my timing was perfect, I guess you could say. And that's when I jumped into real estate. Oh my goodness. You started it during the pandemic. Mm-hmm. It was probably like the worst time possibly to start it, but <laughs> the fact that I was able to jump into it and actually did quite well that first year, that's when I was like, okay, under these circumstances, if I can do this, you know, during this time, I know I can do this for a career. I mean, when I when I saw that you had a property management company as well, I was thinking, oh, I wonder if that came first and then you decided, oh yeah, I'll do CAM, so <laughs> then I'll go on and, and be a realtor. Chicken egg? Somewhat. So basically, yeah. once I became a realtor and, you know, a lot of customers sometimes would say about how they had property. So I saw it as an opportunity to, you know, start my own business and basically feed that same customer base for my real estate into the property management. So you actually have an informational webinar coming up. Mm -hmm. Tell me about that and what, what you're going to be informing people about. So in the month of June, I haven't decided on the date yet, but myself and my preferred lending officer, we're going to do a webinar for a lot of like first time home buyers. So a lot of folks out there, I noticed with my customer clientele, they're just not informed on like the whole home buying process. So I feel that going out there and giving them those tips and debunking a lot of the myths out here is going to be really helpful for a lot of folks. Yes. Do you have a specific um, audience that you cater for? What's your, what are your ideal clients? Typically, I would probably say first time home buyers and mm -hmm. VA customers. I've noticed that I get a lot of VA customers and actually before I left the corporate world, one of my jobs were Wounded Warrior Project, the nonprofit. Mm -hmm. So now what I'm doing is I created some flyers I'm gonna share with like a lot of the warriors at Wounded Warrior Project to kind of let them know that I'm very experienced with VA loans. I was a former employee of it, so that's definitely one of my audiences that I focus on. And is this something that they all know, that they, they have got these benefits that are, that are available for them or not? A lot of them don't. A lot of them don't. A lot of them don't realize that they can you know, use their VA loan you know, several times. A lot of them doesn't realize that you know, it's no down payment with VA loans. So <laughs> I want to educate them on that. You know, they've done their part in serving our country, so it's an amazing benefit that they get. So it's not just real estate and property management, but you've also got some events coming up, haven't you? Oh yeah, definitely. Um, I love serving in the community. That's my heart and soul right there. That's my passion more than anything. So um, in a few weeks for Easter, I'm going to be giving out free gas cards at my church, which is 2051 Ashland Street. Uh, that's going to be at 1030 a.m. And then also in the month of May, I'm doing my first ever kickball tournament called Kicking for Kids, which is raising money and all the proceeds go to like all the different community outreach events I do throughout the year. Busy, busy, busy. Yes. But that's not all, is it? Because I believe you're thinking about going into television. Yes, that is also true. <laughs> so there's this um, local network here in Jacksonville. It's been around for about a year now. It's called Lit TV. So they have like a streaming app on Roku. And basically they have like a lot of like black entertainment type of um, shows and everything like that. So one of the things that I'm going to be doing is starting a real estate show with them, just giving like informational, sitting here at a desk, just like you and I having different guests and just informing the public on things. Fantastic. 
How wonderful! Yes. So, if people want to find at you to、uh -huh. sell a house, or they need a property manager, or they want to buy a house, how do they get hold of you? So, pretty much everything is branded D Sales Jax.、Uh, my Instagram is D Sales Jax. Facebook is D Sales Jax, and my website is D Sales Jax dot com. So that makes it easy. I have like the property management channels as well, but they can contact me there and then kind of lead them from there. It's a no brainer. It's no brainer, Mr. Richardson. <laughs> thank you so much for yes, coming in and talking to us. I appreciate it's a pleasure. it. And don't forget, if you'd like to know any more information, you can find it on dcellsjacks dot com or iwannabuzz dot com. See you next week.